This is Rishan. He's a 9 to 5 guy from Delhi. He wakes up in the morning, does his chores, and irons his clothes by the coal iron of his grandfather. He takes the coal and never uses it completely. He throws it half used. He takes his car along with him when going to office. When he goes to the petrol pump for filling up diesel in his car, he finds a long queue. He has been noticing this for the past few weeks. He finally gets the petrol. But when he goes to sleep that night, he has a dream. In that dream, there are no resources available. There is no coal for ironing his clothes. And he witnesses a blackout. When he takes his car for the office, no diesel is available at the petrol pump. He has to cancel all the plans for his day and he has to go through many losses. So as we saw, if he keeps on wasting resources like this, they will soon get exhausted. Now let's see some alternative resources we can use. We can organize awareness camps. By organizing them, we can tell people about its pros and cons and tell them to conserve it for future. Second, we can use substitutes of non renewable resources solar panels. We can put solar panels in rural areas so we can get light, heat, electricity through it. Wind energy, mostly found in rural areas of India like Rajasthan etc. Wind is used to generate electricity and transport it to rural areas and villages. We can also use gober gas or biogas as a medium of fuel in spite of petroleum. Hydroelectricity. Mainly we know this as the energy generated through water. This is the largest source of alternative energy. We can also recycle resources such as copper, plastic, paper, aluminium, etc. Prohibiting the wastage of resources. We should use public transport for avoiding the wastage of resources. Or by using cooking gas judiciously or economically. By always switching off lights and fans when not in use. This planet which you call our home. We should start treating it like one.